All right, guys, I'm going to be doing a test here with a new virtual desktop streamer app. Uh, it's got a bunch of new uh, features on there, and I'm not going to go through everything. The main thing is um, the foveated rendering that I want to test out, and I've already tested it in a previous uh, uh, day, but I want to record this session and uh, let you guys see the results. It actually works very well. Uh, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started here in VR and uh, right now I have it turned off. It is at 100%. Let me go ahead and get it into VR. All right, I'm just going to adjust my seat here. There we go. And this is about normal. This is kind of what I, you know, normally get about 28. Uh, to 30 frames per second. Um, I do have uh, my settings in a, a combination of uh, medium, high, and ultra. So let's go ahead, just by reducing it to 90%, it'll start decreasing uh, my field of view a little bit uh, to 90%, but it's not really that bad, actually. 90% is very, very doable. Now you are supposed to restart the application and your game but as you can see it is working for me and I I have it on the VDXR runtime so maybe that's why it is um, you know maybe it doesn't need to be uh, restarted in that situation but I am getting uh, roughly about uh, three frames per second three to uh, let, me, let me just hold off here. Yeah, three to four frames per second just by going to 90%. Now, 90% is still very um, comfortable. Like, I can, I can look around and it doesn't really bother me at all as far as, like, the uh, my field of view. You start to see it more when you start going down a little bit further to, to 80 or so, uh, which I'll do right now. But I just want you guys to see how much it actually works. It does a great job. And even at 80%, it's still very, uh, it, it's pretty good as far as like the field of view. It's not that bad. I don't know if I would go much lower than this actually, but as you can see from my 28 frames per second, I've gone up to 34 frames per second. So it's about two to three frames per second. Let's just say about three frames per second for every 10 that you go down. So that actually works very nicely. You know what I'll do is just for the fun of it, I'm gonna go down to, you know what, let's go all the way to the, to the lowest setting. We'll go to 40%. Now this is gonna be literally like a pinhole that I'm looking through. Not quite, but it is a much smaller box. It doesn't look as nice. Um, it looks almost like at a, I'm at a movie theater. That's kind of what it looks like to me. It doesn't feel as immersive, but as you can see, it has gone up to like about 45 frames per second, just sitting on the ground here in Athens, Greece. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it back to 90 because that's kind of where I, I feel comfortable with. And yeah, I just wanted to do this quick short video here for you guys just so you can see what it's like and I will catch you guys later. Take care.